Ephesians chapter 2 verse 5 and 6. Even when we were dead in trespasses, made us alive together with Christ, by grace you have been saved, and raised us up together, and made us sit together in the heavenly places in Christ Jesus. There are many believers who are defeated, because they are struggling to qualify for God's blessings, through their own works. What you need to understand is that, self-effort will rob you of reigning in life by God's grace. You cannot earn your salvation, healing, or financial breakthrough by your own efforts. If the greatest miracle, being saved and made alive with Jesus, comes by grace through faith, and not by your works, how much more the lesser miracles, such as healing, provision, and restored marriages. It is not about your work or performance, but Jesus' work and performance. Only His work is a finished work. And not only did He sit down at the Father's right hand, but today's scripture states that, He also made us sit with Jesus. What does this mean? Sitting down, in the Bible is a picture of the believer, resting in the perfect and finished work of Jesus. Christ has finished all the work on the cross on our behalf, and is now seated at the right hand of God. As it has all been accomplished on our behalf, this means that you can stop depending on your self-efforts, to earn and qualify for God's blessings in your life. You can sit down with Jesus at the Father's right hand. I am not advocating a life of passiveness and laziness, regarding the study of God's Word, prayer, or worship. God's grace does not make you lazy and unproductive. On the contrary, it makes you labor more abundantly for His glory. The Apostle Paul, a preacher of God's grace and the finished work of Jesus, said that he labored more abundantly than they all. What you need to realize is in the New Covenant, God's way is to bless you first, and the knowledge of His blessing, then empowers you to labor more abundantly. In other words, we do not labor to be blessed, but rather we have the power to labor, because we are already blessed. Can you see the different premise for laboring in the New Covenant? Beloved, Jesus has accomplished everything for us on the cross. Our part is to trust in His perfect work. Receive with open arms His abundance of grace, and His gift of righteousness, and sit down and begin to reign in life through Him. Today, let it be your prayer that, you will stop trying to earn God's grace and righteousness. Let the Holy Spirit teach you to start depending on Jesus' finished work, and to start receiving by His grace. This is God's way to success, wholeness, and victorious living. Thanks for watching. If you are blessed by this video, please don't forget to like and comment. Feel free to share with someone who needs God's grace right now. Kindly subscribe and click the bell icon to get notified. And watch other inspirational videos like this.